Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a different sort of video for me today, guys. No gameplay today. We are just going to have a little chat. Hopefully you can grin and bear it. If you can, there'll be a nice little treat for you right at the end of the video. Today, uh, it's Monday today. Today, um, I got an email from a um, small indie dev uh, who goes by the name of Raddy, also known as RoboDev. And um, he was trying to generate some interest for his game, which comes out on Early Access on the 19th of July, so a week on Wednesday or Wednesday week, called Obscure. And it's a um, puzzle adventure game. He sent me over some text and, and different bits and pieces, and most of it's on the, the Steam page anyway, which you can now see on here. I'll link it down in the description as well, so you can all head on over there if you want to. Basically, he's trying to do something unique, something different, and he's taken a lot of inspiration from games like Journey, um, Abzu, and The Witness. And for anybody who knows me and has been around for a while, everybody will know, they will know that The Witness was my standout game of 2016, my definitely my game of the year. So to have that game as an inspiration is always kind of interesting to me. To give you a bit of a background from what I've taken from the store page and the media that I've received, the game you play as an orphan boy and um, he's been the like subject of abuse and bullying like his entire life, and um, he's even tried to like commit suicide a couple of times in the orphanage, um, which is you know quite dark. You know, escapes one night into a dream, where he hears this woman calling his name, and he, he sure it's his he sure it's his mother in his dream that's calling her. So every night from then, he then goes into his dreams to try and find his parents and try and help him understand why he was left and, and what he's actually doing at the orphanage and you know why why they left him there basically so um the game takes place in the child's dreams which is like a world of imagination so anything is possible you've got like these really nice as you can probably see from some of the screens you've got these really nice looking environments like the witness had like you know really visually it looks really nice but then you've got the child's imagination side of it so basically anything is possible and you may see in some of the videos and snippets and stuff that like you've got like these blocks appearing out. And I just, I interpret that as, you know, the child is trying to solve something. So he's using the imagination to give him a way to cross over and solve that puzzle. So, um, yeah, I'm really interested in this. Like I said, it comes out a week on Wednesday, so the 19th of July. And it also takes um, another aspect, a lot of literature and ancient texts and different bits and pieces um as well so it's almost got like a element of talos thrown into there because i know talos was very um ancient scripture sort of um influenced on the terminal stories and different bits and pieces but um yeah so i'm looking forward to the game guys hopefully you'll if, if you are interested you know you'll you'll follow and um keep an eye on it but i have no information about pricing or anything like that so i'm a bit unsure as to how much uh, the game will be on release. Like I say, it's going to be an early access game, uh, but I have no information as yet of pricing or anything like that. However, what I do have is three Steam keys to give away, courtesy of the developers for you know trying to help generate some interest in the game. And um, we're going to basically offer them off as a competition in uh, in this video. So yeah, if you want to get your hands on a copy of this as soon as I get my hands on the Steam keys, uh, which are probably going to be on the 19th, I don't think I'm going to have uh, any early, early access to the game. So on the 19th, um, I will get four keys, one for myself and three to give away. If you want a chance to win one of those keys, all you have to do is tell me the four games that I have referenced as inspiration for this game. Three of them are in the text on the Steam page, and one of them I mentioned on myself. You can tell me in the comments down below um, all four games. I will put all entries into a random draw on the 19th, and I will do a video picking out three winners at complete random. If I only get three entries, then obviously each of those people will get a key, and I'll be only do a random draw. But Assuming I get more than three, I'll do a random video and um, you have the chance to win one of the three keys. So yeah, leave me your comments, guys. Let me know what you think. I said I would also men uh, link the video to the dev. So if you've got any comments about the game, either leave them on the Steam page, uh, oh, sorry, on the community page, leave them in the comments and I'm sure they'll take a look at them over there. But everybody, good luck. Hope you, um, if you enter the competition, hopefully you'll win yourself a key. I'm looking forward to the game and I'll be covering it as and when it comes out. But until next time, I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Happy gaming.